Hello, welcome back to my Mario tutorial in Scratch. In this episode, we're going to add in coins. Um, so, yeah, we're going to put in coins like this. Well, we're going to finish off from our previous part, which was just putting in the coins, but now we're going to add the collisions. So, um, yeah, you just want to open up your Scratch project. And, um, oh, here it is. Um, and then in here, uh, yeah, you just we haven't got the collisions yet so yeah and also you are going to want to um, get this sound off the internet um, which I got from that same website um, from my adding sounds tutorial but um, I'll put the link in the description if you want to download that because we'll use that in our uh, in our project so um, you want to go into your each coin one and just import the sound and yes yeah, this one and coin two and coin three. Now the annoying thing is with Scratch, you can't just put it like in the stage, and it's a, and it's available to all sprites. You have to put them in each individual sprite. But yeah, that's just Scratch. <laughs> um. Anyway. Um. So yeah, we now we want to put in a uh, when I receive thing, and we want to name this like coin one hit. Uh, for, so for coin, for coin one, um, where is it gone? Uh, right, okay. So um, yeah, and then, and then we just want to put in a uh, play sound, and then just a hide. And so in our Mario thingy we can just put in um, basically a forever loop just testing whether um, Mario is touching the the coins so um, yeah we where is it sensing touching and then coin one which is this one and um, in that we can just broadcast that thing coin one hit and then we just want to duplicate this for all the other ones. So coin two, let's create a new one called coin two hit, um, and coin three, and coin three hit, like that. Um, and we'll just clean that up, just so it's nice and tidy, <laughs> um, and. We, we're going to want to put in a wait time at the bottom for about 0 0.03 seconds otherwise there'll be like a, um, a D what you call a D bounce thing which is basically well a bounce thing because like it, this will this is this will go really rapidly without this wait time and pro that'll probably get triggered two times if we if, if, if we collide with this coin one so we just put in a tiny wait time just to stop that from happening um, and yeah, that is basically it. Um, now we've just got to put in the, uh, the for the coin two, um, and I think you you need to click the arrow again and then select it again. Otherwise, it will be referring to the one in there. So yeah, um, just do that. Otherwise, it might not play the sound. I don't know how Scratch works really. <laughs> it's just the mechanics of scratch I guess um, so yeah that should work now now um yeah the, there is a slight problem in the well yeah there's a few problems at the moment we need to actually show them at the start otherwise they'll be hidden to start with so um, yeah, you get the show thing here and do that for all the different ones just like that and then that will show to start with now we're probably going to want in to put in a coin count to store how many coins Mario's collected. So for that we're just basically going to make a variable called coins. And we can position this just like uh, uh, wherever we want really. Oh yeah. Just there because otherwise we haven't got this screen thing here. So you want to put it to the, left, to the right of that. Um, so yeah to start with, in, we go back to our Mario sprite. We want to set coins to zero, and then that was so pointless. <laughs> Let's 
clean up. I'm so totally obsessed with cleaning it all up. Anyway, <laughs> change, and then we just gotta change the coins by one each time, just like that. There we go again, cleaning it up again. Um, but yeah, as you can see, that works now. Uh, works quite nicely. Um, yeah, that is pretty much it, really, for this tutorial. Um, I hope you enjoyed and all that. Um, this you can download this project if not, if something doesn't work. There's a link in the description to download it, and you can just sort of compare scripts and stuff. Um, but yeah, apart from that, I'll see you in the next tutorial. Um, hopefully, um, and yeah, it should be a marriage tutorial next. Um, but yeah, it should be good. So see you then. Bye.